Hi guys, I'm Riley, and in today's video, I'll be showing you what I just got at Sephora and Victoria's Secret. So, to start us off, Sephora. It's really cute. Okay, might do something with that. So, the first thing I got was from Fenty Beauty, and it was the Matchsticks Highlighter in Confetti. And I've gotten a few things from Fenty Beauty, and I just love it. You see that? I thought confetti was a nice color. I have not used this yet, but I'm really excited to because it has amazing reviews. And just listen to this click. Well, so the next thing I got... This is also from Fenty Beauty, but this was the Fenty Gloss Balm. And so this one, really shiny, really shimmery. I wore this to school this morning, and I got a lot of compliments. And I was like, wow. The next thing I got was, I know it's small. This is the mini cooling stick cooling water stick from Milk Makeup, and um, I wanted the bigger one, but they only have the mini, so I wasn't going to be like, you know. So what you do is, just put it under your eyes, in your cheeks, and then you just rub it in. And you can put it on in the morning after you wake up. Or after, you know, you have a breakdown because you realize that your schoolwork is due in four hours and it's two o'clock in the morning. It's here for you. But the Sephora I went to didn't carry any of the large ones, so I had to get the mini one. I mean, it's fine. It's better than nothing. That's, that's what I was thinking. The next thing I got was this Glam Glow Pout Mud, and it's part of a, a set of the Glam Glow Pout Mud exfoliating and nourishing parts, but this is the Tropical, Flu Tropical Fruit Blend, and this is the uh, Fizzy Lip Exfoliating Treatment. And so, there's supposed to be a nourishing balm that comes after it, but I didn't get it because I have so many lip balms, it's not even funny. But, let me open it. So, I don't know if you can see that. It's basically just like... So, yeah. I had to use this. Ooh. Oh. Exfoliating lip treatment. Pucker up. Apply liberally and massage onto lips for a few seconds to pre exfoliate. Gently massage with water to activate fizzing renewal action. Rinse with warm water. Use two to three times per week. And after, it says there's a wet lip balm treat. And that's the one that I didn't get because. So. The next thing I got from Sephora was actually a Sephora product. And so, it's funny because when I was grabbing it off the shelf, I was just grabbing, I just grabbed it because it was pink and it said hair mask and I was like, oh cool, fun. But then when I, when I looked at it after I bought it, it was for um, Silky Smooth Anti-Frizz, which is perfect because all my hair does is frizz. So this works. And so this is the actual cap for it and this is the actual mask. But it's, it's made with rose oil. Yeah, it's a rose hair sleeping mask. 
So you just put the cream in before you go to bed, you put the cap on, and in the morning, you leave it on overnight. And in the morning, you take a shower, you rinse it out, and then your hair is supposed to be perfect. So the last thing I got from Sephora was this Shake and Shot mask from Dr. Jart. And I've never, the only thing I've ever used from Dr. Jart is this hydro cream, and it's a moisturizer. And so, what you do is, it gives you these two ingredients, and I'll have another video for this. But, it gives you these ingredients, this one's a liquid, and this one's like a cream, I think. But you pour them into the cup, you put the lid on and you shake it, and then you leave it for a minute. And then when you, uh, you have to put it on within like a minute. Or like two, it says two or three minutes of mixing up the mask. And then after you put it on, it transforms from like the cream into like the gel that you can like take off. But you don't have to use water to take it off. And when you peel it, it's not like one of those peel masks that rips all of your skin off when it does. And it has different purposes, but I got the rubber soothing mask. I think they had they had the soothing, a firming, and they had two more, but I can't remember what they were. And so that's what I got from Sephora. And so then I went to Victoria's Secret afterwards. This is super cute too. So I might do, might do something with that. And so. And I was checking out, the lady that was checking out, she was like, here you go, you can have this too. And I was like, oh, cool. So I'm pretty sure this is either a pizza or a donut inflatable thing. That, and it holds up this cup. So then they gave me this cup too. And it's super cute. And I hate cups that are like really squishy and bumpy. And like this one's, it's not, it works out. It's perfect. So I got two fragrances. I got the new Fresh and Clean. And this one's with the Tiare Flower and Sea Spray. I don't know if you say that right, but whatever. So on the back it says, get fresh with me. And I think that's so cute. And they smell so good. So the next one I got was the new Warm and Cozy. And this one's Vanilla and Sunburst Passion Fruit. And in the, on the back it says, catching major feels. I don't know if you can see that. It's probably not focusing. But whatever. And so it, it smells so good too. So. Alright. That's all I got from Sephora and Victoria's Secret. So hope you enjoy. Have a great day. Bye.